believe in traders and traders y'all know drill casting back to you with another banger all right bye 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 so y'all saw catch a nice hundred tip of this move um this is the play from last night markup yeah but now we have to be extremely careful here right because i picked up the lows right here to catch its break here however we also have some lows right here so let me connect it and see how it looks all right not bad not bad not bad because to extend it, the line to come here that wouldn't make any sense whatsoever all right so let me also give it a fit test all right from here to here see if it come back to 61.8 50 all right so definitely not looking like that retracement to me right not looking like that retracement to me so pretty device the same the same the same situation gonna hold right same situation gonna hold sells below 183.306 right however because we broke down here and retest created a lower high here right so watch the break let me get rid of this so broke here broke here shift retest lower high right here broke down right here and now we're creating resistance right here right creating resistance right here so instead of having the buy range up here now right you can remove this right let's remove this remove this and the bias is much more clear now right this trend can change now all right this is the connection now all right so this is the connection that we're looking at this is the connection that we're looking at all right let's check this line right here of h4 all right nice little zone nice little zone we have roof here roof here it's a paper out here, floor here, all right? So nice little zone. Nice little zone going across. All right, so nice respected zone going straight across, right? So watch me now, so it's simple. Once price is below, remember that trend line, just like our support and resistance is an era, not a line. The trend line is also, right? An era and not just a line, so it's an era, right? It's an era and not just a line all right if you're new to the channel right trend line is an era not just a line all right so can have resistance somewhere about here to come back in and so on so it sells below 183 306 and buys above 183 306 so if we get up at pre pre london um london open and we see resistance forming somewhere around here right the bullish candle closure we cut the top bearish candle closure we cut the top then we're going to look to continue down for the sell, all right. If it's a situation where price shift, create a higher high, retest, create a higher low, confirming the basic of trading for option, right? Voiding the lower high right here, right? Voiding the, the definition of a, a downtrend. All you have to do is wait on support to form. Bearish candle closure, weeks at the bottom. Bullish candle closure, weeks at the bottom, and then you're going to look for your buys, all right? And remember, we're going to look for these entries in time of volume pre London, London open, or possibly um, pre Asian, Asian open. All right? So we have to just see what the volume looks like because this entry that I caught was at pre Asian, right? Because I, I realized that there's been a lot of volume in pre Asian, Asian open. This was pre Asian, Asian open at, at Sunday. So I said to myself that I had to be a little bit more assertive and to see where the shift in volume is because the yen is extremely volatile right now so i'm just sitting back and see how how long will the yen be volatile right do we have like some news coming out tomorrow if memory serves me right i think we have some gdp somewhere around around floating around in the week so we just have to be mindful of the calendar in the week right as well so check your calendars up at pre london london open we discussed this in the sunday video all right so ensure that you check your calendar and see where we are on the calendar all right so 
this can also we can also look at something like this right bomb and low here break there right so several ways to look at it right but downtrend will blow this lower high right lower low i should say blow this lower low retested right here created a lower high confirmed the definition of a downtrend right created a lower low back to create a lower high let's see if this lower high maintains at the time of volume right so this is the markup let me set it up for you so bam gonna look to continue down in this nice little downtrend or we're gonna take buys above here bam to continue up right however the first scenario that we're looking for is sell right this is the main scenario that we're going to look for because as i said that we're in a massive downtrend um gg has been in a, a strong option for the past year and a half and i said to you that i know that the turnover is going to come anytime soon so it look like we are finally in that turnover if you didn't catch yesterday's markup uh, what we we're looking at was this this is the uptrend structure breaker structure bam Broke those broke the lower low shift retest lower high. This is a 700 pip drop shift retest lower high now, right? And to create the retracement, and now we're looking for that impulse move to continue down. So remember, it's a lower low, lower high, bam, lower low, come back lower high to continue down that type of movement. So this is how it looks off the higher time frame. But off the from the higher time frame, we can catch um so the overall direction where where prices goes in in terms of the, the structure on the swing but this upward movement right here that upward movement right there that retracement from the h4 level we can ascertain higher highs and higher lows and catch this nice little move going up and then now we can look at the structure going back down now with lower highs and lower lows to catch the impulse move going down so that is what we're looking at so we're we're maintaining a downtrend until structure tell us otherwise if you have any questions traders and traders reach out in the comment section you know i'm here to help each and everyone i answer each and every comment i'm very active in the comment section so just drop a message in the comment section reach out on social me media i'm here once again to help each and every trader and traders until tomorrow straight balling no stalling I'm out.